At EVSE, home charging for us is about powering people's lives. We're powering the way that people get to and from work to pick up their kids um, and go about their day-to-day -day lives. So it's really important for us that solutions are simple, seamless and easy to use. In 2014, Sam and myself were in Europe and we saw electric vehicles for the first time. It was our first exposure to the technology and we were really taken away by the charges lined across the streets and the fact that the cars had no sound or emissions from them. So we raced back home, started a business from his garage. We'd seen the future. We were very passionate about what the technology was opening up and because of that, we are able to push through that. On the other side of that now, we have a great business that supports Australia's transition to clean emissions vehicles. People are moving to EVs because they see it as just better technology. Uh, it's a better experience. I'm Kylie, I'm a mum of two. I've driven an EV for uh, three years. It's really safe to drive. You feel like you can view the road easier. There's a lot of warnings for things that might show up. I feel like the hazard reduction is significant compared to a normal petrol vehicle. Charging at home is just seamless. It just means that I don't have to worry about going to a public charging place, waiting around and entertaining two children at the same time. It makes no sense. That's the reason most of my friends that are updating their cars are going to EV. They can just charge it at home and it just solves one of the other life challenges. And then now I can not worry about doing petrol. Having an EV has changed my life in many ways. I've got a charging station here at home as well as at work. So for me, I simply wake up fully charged, drive to work, plug in there, and I really don't have to go out of my way to do any recharging. On top of that, with my smart charger, I can utilise off-peak times, my solar, to make it really, really cheap and clean to charge my EV. Charging an EV is more like powering up your phone than it is putting petrol in your car. You simply come home, plug it in and go to sleep, and it's fully charged the next day. For a lot of people, range anxiety is a factor which restricts them for, for trialling an EV. But what we know is that according to the ABS, most Australians are travelling about 40 k's a day. With today's EVs, with a range of upwards of 400 kilometres, that's only charging once or twice a week. Owning an electric vehicle, I know when I go out to go to work or to pick up the kids, that I'm doing my bit to reduce my carbon footprint. My name is Brendan Wheeler and I'm the co-founder of EVSE and an EV driver.